I was actually told Mr. Biglaran is watching us right now on Zoom, but we will be connecting with him a bit shortly during our panel, which will be happening next. But it is my extreme honor to award Mr. Artak Biglaran with the Freedom Award. The Freedom Award is awarded to an individual who has made extraordinary contributions to human freedom in Nagorno-Karabakh. Artak Beglarian has exemplified this through his courageous efforts to aid the people of Nagorno-Karabakh as the human rights ombudsman of the Republic of Artsakh, also known as Nagorno-Karabakh. But Mr. Beglarian, we all know that he was encouraged to pursue his career as at the age of six, when he stepped on the landmine and broke, breaking his bones in his body and rendering him almost uh, completely blind. He was on the grounds during the 44-day war in 2020, which he obviously witnessed firsthand. He met with the individuals on the ground to assess their humanitarian needs as well as the infrastructural needs. We all remember him as the voice of the ongoing war as he was wearing a bulletproof vest as the bombs were falling from the sky. He partook in the uh, fact-finding mission and collected evidence. In his capacity, Mr. Beglarian became the voice of the victims by communicating their situation by way of reports, interviews, and speeches to the media, the international bodies, and congressional officials. Mr. Beglarian complied compiled and shared extensive reports documenting the extrajudicial killings, destruction of cultural property, and indiscriminate shelling of civilian infrastructure. And these are just to name a few. He has been a champion for human freedom and in Artsakh, which is to really say the least. And it is our extreme honor to award the Freedom Award to Mr. Artag Beglarian on behalf of the entire Center for Truth and Justice. Thank you.